Well, good night everyone. Welcome back to another edition of Jay's Modded Minecraft Exploration. This is for 1 16.5 Java Edition. Let me straighten up my pop guard. There we go. Uh, so, this is another late night stream as I got tired of hearing the knock knock, ringy ringy and ding dong of the doorbell knocking and all that other stuff. So, now, well here we are with the cow pen. And remember the last time we were here, we fired up the portal room, and we were starting to do some of the sheep pen. So, um, we need to do is kind of get together, or not get together, put together uh, the the farm today, and maybe we can start breeding more cows and start forming up ourselves a little workshop like an enchanting room with a crafting table and all that stuff at an anvil. We'll see if we can get ourselves a layout for one. So we gotta do our morning farming. It's what you do on a farm in the morning you get up early and speaking of that I hate when you get up early in the morning and someone cancels their appointments with you. And meetings and stuff. I'm like, you know, I could have used that time to sleep in. But some people are just not considerate, I guess. Huh? Okay, so pretty much today we're just going to be doing that. And yeah, I've been working a little bit. If you haven't already noticed, if you haven't seen already my post on YouTube, I've been working on the 3D Doors Pack, and I'm trying to find some places to host that so you can download it. Remember I said after I got a thousand subs on this channel, I was going to start making these available. Well, I'm working on the Crimson Door right now, so uh, once you write up a template, it gets pretty easy after that. So that's what I've been up to. And that's pretty much the gist on this. Remember, I promised, you know, I'm not going to go against my word on it. I already said I'm going to give you guys access to the downloadable pack. So, but I don't want to give you just some junk, I want to give you something good. All right. You know if it's an odd number. Well, let's grab one more here. There we go. Okay. So yeah, that's pretty much what's been going on, but nothing major or anything, you know. And, been working a little bit on the Lego channel, putting together building guides, and trying to rustle up some supporters for Patreon so I can continue doing my work. Um, you know, at least here I haven't done that yet. Yet. <laughs> but, you know, Minecraft is something I enjoy doing, and it's not like I don't enjoy Lego, it's just... <laughs> that, uh... You know, let's say that I'm, my video, my tutorials are a little too slow, and I have to agree with them, but some people just get kind of rude with me, and I'm just like, you know, a constructive criticism is always good, but some don't know what that is. And speaking of that, off the other Minecraft episode that I've been doing, um, I've been getting some more rude comments on that lately, and... How slow I am on playing that. I'm like, you know what? It's going to be at the point one day where I'll go so fast. So I'm referring people to these. And if they don't want to watch these type of Minecraft exploration gameplays, well, that's on them, not on me. So, like right now, I'm going to work on the sheep pen today and uh, breed these cows. Maybe we'll have to put ourselves a chicken coop next, huh? So yeah, I'd like to get into modding more than anything else. Oh, the chicken is waiting for the new coop to be built. Well, soon enough. Let 
Well, I'm getting there. I'll have to harvest more trees, but we'll see what we can do. I may put the sheep right here. We've got to fix up this path again. Look how leveled that is now. I got that puppy pretty level. Whoops. Okay, so uh, we like to uh, make a lecture, and if possible, and put it in here. And yes, I got my 3D door packs on. So hopefully, pretty soon you'll be able to download this and uh, just be like, "Cool, I get to have 3D doors," and it works for vanilla. You don't have to have a mod for any of this stuff. In fact, I need to try it on my older laptop and see if it'll run it before I let you guys and gals uh, poke around with it. I know a lot of people don't have a medium to high-end gaming PC and uh, can't really play all that. I haven't got to that tree yet. So, so far we're getting a farm put together which is cool. But what I need to do is get more of this farm built. And see what we can do about some stuff. But these episodes are going to be like the original, but we're going to scale them down. We're going to do things a little differently. Instead of building cabins with portals, I'm going to build portals with cabins. So basically I'm going to go into the nether. We're going to put a portal up every 125 blocks, and we're going to be surprised where it takes us. And we'll go from there. So this is a little different. Uh, I've been getting a few of my friends commenting on these. and uh, Some of you like these. Uh, because it's different and it's well, there's more noises and stuff in here too more bells and whistles and stuff so all I gotta do is just let me know that's you know I'm not like one of those bigger youtubers where I'll ignore you although some prefer that I don't know why but all right let's kind of round that up a bit there we go so Let's see if we can make some more gates and put some gates around this. And cow say no, I say yes. So let's get this going here. So yeah, sound, sorry if it sounds like I'm a little tired. I've had a very long week. I'm, t you know, Mondays drain me out. So yeah, I may be delayed by answering comments and stuff. I know. Uh, uh, my friend was asking if I could do some more, you know, maybe like introduce new mods and stuff. I, I could do that, you know, I don't mind. You know, here's the thing. If somebody's willing to share their mod pack with me or their forge pack, yeah, I don't mind. Like, they share them publicly. I'll, 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 I'll promote it and stuff, you know. It's only fair. I'm using their, their content and my content, so it's just fair to give them a bit of a shout out. You know, some people don't do that. Some people just steal your stuff and claim it is theirs. I don't know why you would, but some people do that. All right. Here we made ourselves a gate for the new sheep pen. Okay, so we got this as the middle. One, two, three, four. So it is nine interiors. One, two, three. Pretend that one's four and put the gate there. Okay. So... Not put the sheep in there, they just won't stay in there. Plus I can rip apart that other horse pin if I need to. So yeah, we're not going to be doing a lot of exploring in here yet. My main goal also, like I said, is to get the farm with a good steady supply of food. We got, of course, we got plenty of water out there. And we got ourselves some shelter. So it's, uh... It's pretty rough, but we're okay with that right now. So yeah, as I'm playing this, my 3D doors pack is not done yet, because i got to do crimson door and a crimson trap door. Warp door and a warp trap door. And yeah, 
I don't get a lot of feedback on those, but I remember a few in the past were asked me where do they download it, and I'm like, uh, it's not for download yet. I still gotta clean and polish it up and stuff, and because I don't want to give you guys some bloated, you know, thing. All right, let's go to bed because obviously I don't want the scary things to come in here and get me. I already see something red moving on the map. We gotta hide. Wow. Well, good morning, and as you saw, this guy here jacked my bed. So, yes. Don't ask me why he did not know that that was not his. And two, I need to make some more beds in Minecraft. So, yes, I will do that. So, let's see if we can move the sheeps over into this pen today. May not have it done. Um, a lectern is a bookshelf and a couple of slabs. So, we'll see if we can build ourselves a lectern and see if we can do some lectures and bore people to death. That kind of thing. Let's see here. Yeah, so far so good. We got a staircase this booger down here. Okay. So far, so good. Yeah, well, I could give you some carrots for emeralds, but you're not the one I'm interested in. Now, don't worry, I'll give you something eventually. As a matter of fact, maybe we should just start building a lecture now, huh? And seeing I don't have a lot of materials yet, we're just going to make ourselves an andesite pickaxe. Well, we only have one piece. I guess you can't do that. Uh, I don't use andesite really for anything, so... You can actually make pickaxes with this and quark. It counts as a stone axe, which is pretty cool. Basically, it's a stone, so... And I should have made a wood axe, but you know what, though? We're going to have a little fun with this. Let's see here. Uh-oh! You get back in there! You're gonna get a whipping now. No! Give me that. Okay, I'm gonna keep hitting everyone until uh until I get some leather. No? Well I didn't you didn't give me anything. Are you it? I don't wanna hit the calflings. Ah. Uh, uh. Come on. Maybe we'll take a picture by the lecture. Man! We can't even catch these guys! Really? Are we not going to give any leather? Oh, about time, but I need three pieces, though. Get out, you get... You get slain. That's exactly what would happen. Oh, well, I need more than just leather now. Now I need some sugar cane. Ooh, almost fell down in that hole. Now we're going to have to be forced to uh, look for some stuff, huh? We're going to have to make ourselves a sugar cane farm next. Yeah, you can sure tell the frame rates sometimes drop like this. It freezes. So, it's just all the mods. Is it safe to go in? See some red things down there. You got to be careful because you got no only drowned in here that like to bother you. But you also got those uh, 
squid and octopi and all that stuff. Alright. Alrighty. I don't think there was piranhas in this. Every time I'm getting attacked is by eel, although I got k killed by an octopus. Yeah, not too fun. I need uh, a bunch of sugar cane anyway, so... We're gonna put it right here. Okay, how's the farms doing, huh? Same old thing. Well, at least this time we got some food. Let's see if we can find some of that raw eel meat just floating around. So, we're working on the sheep pen. We're working on the farm. And we're working on getting stuff for a lecture. So the goal by the end of this episode is hopefully get a lecture going. And the reason being is, is so we can start cycling through our, our villagers' trades. And hopefully we'll get something like maybe Efficiency 5 or Fortune 3 or something that's cool. Or preferably Mending. And then I can start mining for diamond stuff and start making some diamond tools real quick. Yeah, it's kind of cool. A few of my friends and I, we got a little server going right now, and uh, hopefully one day I'll be able to open up a server for 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 fans, and we could all just kind of mess around on Minecraft together and just kind of, you know, kind of explore things and gather up stuff. Wow! Oh, I got sugarcane seeds. I guess that's new. I'll tell you what, we're going to drop those clippers, which is smart, and we're going to put that over there, because the dirt's more important. <laughs> well, as you can see, we're getting pretty far in here. I don't know how some don't like mods. But a lot of people also who watch these are bedrock players. So they probably have missed out a lot on this stuff. They're like, why can't we have this in bedrock? A lot of us have been saying that too. Like my uh, 3D resource pack. Why can't I have that in my bedrock game? It's just not that advanced yet. So, now what these seeds are is that... I'll show you. You can see the sugar cane here is growing at different heights. So, it gives a six now. That means I can start breaking pieces here. I don't think you can bone meal it though, but... I'd like to go look for some more biomes. But I'd really like to get a source of food going first. Start replacing this here. You pull it, you eat it. Don't worry, you'll have your turn on the dinner plate real soon. <laughs> Oh yeah, just move away. Because we are going to get you. Okay.
Oh, those little blue dots there. I, I changed some of my colors on this. They're kind of like for telling me that there's an item that has dropped. Probably a sapping over, sapping, sapling over there. Man, I can crave for barbecue steak right now. Oh, look, there's two saplings in there, too. So, yeah, this is the second game day. We haven't done much of anything yet, to be honest with you. Not gonna lie. Remember, I'm doing three chores at one time, too. Remember, by this time in my old season, this is, this is episode, um, I believe, four. Oh, no, you don't. Get out of that bed. Good morning, everyone, and like I was saying, um, I've actually gone a lot faster than this than I have in the other one, too. So, you know, just can't believe that villager was trying to pull a fast one on me. All right. Still not quite. Let me go back down here and we'll do it again. Very boring, huh? Like I said, it's going to fold the same gameplay, just a little more sped up. Remember, by this time in my fourth season, we were just worrying about getting walls put up. Here, I've already got a bunch of stuff going. You know what, if I, I should, is I should start uh, breeding uh, these ducks. I mean chickens. Although there's geese in this game, too. You don't eat seeds? Here, we'll start there. Alright, let's see what we have here. Can't go too far, but... Well, they're not in ra rings, so there's probably no treasure in there. Well, I have to dig one of those fairy rings up. Oh, you know what? Let's grab one of those pumpkins. Let's just grab a pumpkin. I thought I saw something in there. Here we go again. Maybe it's the mini map doing that. Who knows it was doing another gameplay, so, you know, pros outweigh the cons. You know, I gotta be careful. Splat. what's out here I want to find some new biomes there's some more sugar cane I guess I can grab that while I'm here well, my goal today really is to get a lecture going so get any seeds this time no I got the regular seeds should take some of that birch back with me Oh, there's a spruce. Um, 
and an annoying bird and I'm wearing headphones so yeah rest in peace my poor little ears So, I really don't see anything around here. So this, remember though, I didn't have a lot of these mods installed too, so I have to go a little further to get them to work. Maybe we'll have to go in there or something, huh? So let's go ahead and let's uh, finish up the farm. Matter of fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here and kind of fill up this uh, compost bin with some seeds just to empty out my inventory. Yes, I'm using your compost bin. Hopefully not picking up my stuff. I've worked hard to throw that in there. Alright, let's see here. I'm just going to drop some of this down here. See what we get. Uh, same old junk. I get a new flower or something. I guess they don't work with this. Yeah, just a bunch of weeds. Okay. I'm going to do right now, I'm going to grow an oak sapling here. Let's see if we can lock another one of these villagers in his house so we can preserve him. We need to keep the prisoners in check, so that's exactly what we're going to do. Really all the gates do is just protect them from escaping. Because you know how these villagers are, right? They'll sometimes they'll just sit there and let, let themselves get attacked. This one here has got a gate. This guy here is. Of course, I got to find a way to get in here. Well, you're safe now. That takes care of him. <laughs> We got three villagers already protected now, so that's a good start. Just gotta add some more beds out here. I think it's beds, doors, beds, doors, and torches for them to breed. Farm's doing okay. Let's go ahead and shave off a few more blocks here. So yeah, this is gonna be kind of like a dull game day today. You gotta work before you can play. Yeah, I like to get into more of the modding stuff. Kind of set up my environmental variables and stuff like that for Eclipse for Forge. So I gotta set up my job environment and start playing around with that. I'll probably come out with some pretty crazy mods, but as far as for textures go, now we'll save that for someone who can actually do textures, because I'm not good with graphics design. There's a couple of mods I'd like to do. I'm not going to leak out my ideas right now, but there's stuff that I kind of want to add to the game. Okay, how's our little sugar cane doing, huh? Seven, eight, nine. You can see now where these are different heights. So you gotta wait for them to get up to three. It's the same speed. It's just you have to wait for things, and that's okay. Now, if you're if you're looking for a speed play, this is probably not the video for you. 
Oh yeah, the other day I had someone tell me to shut up and just play Minecraft, too. Yeah, they won't be joining my channel anymore. I just like, wow, really? I had an ASMR series that nobody watched. It's still there. Okay. Alright, so, so far we haven't done anything with the sheet pin yet, but I'm still working on the lectern. May not have the lectern done, because I don't think we can use the bone meal for it. What I should do right now is start working on the carrots. The carrot farm. Actually, I want to put... This is going to be my potatoes. This will be my carrot. Let's just start. And this over here will be my beetroot. So let me grab a... Well, I can't even grab a pail of water. Yeah, I guess I'll have to set it in there. I don't have anything. Oh, I got some stuff I can cook. Yeah. We'll cook that eel meat up. There we go. There's some food right there. Remember back in the days of Minecraft, I'd starve. Yep, it's still not growing pretty good. This will be for beetroot. So, we'll start with that. And guess what? It's already dark time. <laughs> I mean, I just, I haven't done anything yet. Well, good morning again! Here we go with the fourth game day. And, you know, honestly, guys and gals, it is nice not to be bothered by the doorbell or the phone or anything. I don't think those carrots are ready, but hard to say. I guess they are. So that's exactly what I'm doing right now. I'm going to pull out everything and make that strictly my, whatchamacallit. Whoops, there we go, we're getting sloppy with the hoe again. I'm only pulling stuff that's ready right now, so... Well, you can really tell I got pretty far in this, huh? Okay. We've got our potatoes, which is the main thing I'm worried about right now in here. Wait a minute, I'm putting carrots in there. My bad. Well, at least we have the leather for the bookshelves. There we go. Let's see here. Whoops, well that's not supposed to be pulled, but we pulled it anyways, huh? Well, I guess that's not supposed to be pulled, it wasn't ready. Yeah, let's go ahead and... Uh, one more row here. And that should do it. And then let's start working on our beetroot nonsense. Okay. Boy, some of these are just not, you can't tell if they're grown or not. Of course, they're not all the same thing either, so. 
I shouldn't have pulled that one, but I did. These look like they're done. It's hard when you got all this other junk in here, too. Alright. Let's go check our furnace. We'll put that in there. And... Let's see here. Uh, got our gate. How's our sugar cane doing? Doing okay, I guess. Still growing. Alright. Let's go back in here and we're going to pull more of this out. Really like to get a farm going out here as much as I can. And one thing good about Minecraft is there's no coronavirus in here to spoil our fun. So, we can play without having to wear a silly mask and worry about social distancing. Because, well, in here I'm the only person in this game. So, yeah, I guess it doesn't really exist right now. Okay, let's see if we can make ourselves some more gates. And then what we'll do is see if we can get more of the sheet pin done. Probably going to have someone complain about the frame rate. Somebody already did. Um, one of my things that I'm in, I was like, well, send me the cash and I'll go buy a new graphics card. <laughs> and it was like... Why would I give you $30,000 for a car when I need one? Like, exactly, so don't complain, you know. Things are rare right now. One, two, three, four. Well, I need one more here to go around that corner. Then we'll get our sheeps in there. Matter of fact, let's, uh not put that there obviously all right here we go it's lunch time here we go chow down because I need a, an enchanting room real quick I right, made it to level 10 huh haven't died yet all right gotta give her some we still gotta go find some pigs in here and wrestle them up in there as well Well, I guess I broke that, now did I? Alright, let's go ahead and plant these carrots in here. And I may start to sound like a little congested. Man, I tell you, my allergies have been flaring up. I need some food anyways, so... Now if I want to go on a, on a nice long hike... You see the weed's not ready to be harvested yet. We'll harvest this later. Like the potatoes, I always wait till the crops are fully done. And carrots are just going to use, for, they're just expendable right now. Okay. Um, i really like to get a lecture started. Let's see here. None of this is even done yet. I don't have any bone meal. I could throw some of those oak saplings in there, huh? Okay, let's go ahead and pull more down here. Yeah, I'm really ready for a vacation. I'm kind of tired of being cooped up in the house and 
Really the only thing you can do is basic essential stuff, even though if they got that virus shot. Um, apparently a software engineer is not really considered a essential job. You know if I've kept a lot of people employed over the pandemic because some, you know, didn't even have a website or any kind of database to store their inventory and stuff. Some people were still using books, you know, like ledgers and stuff. I'm like, you think that that would have been a higher priority, but not in my area, it's not. Okay. Let's see here. Well, this doesn't have a library. I've really never have checked all these houses. Oh, that's right. We left those there for purpose, huh? Here, we'll do this too. Oh, look, they're in love. Oh, isn't that cool? Cool. I'll we'll have to get you another gate here to to admire. You know what? We could make another bed for the villagers, but it's like they got plenty of beds. There's one straggler here that keeps snagging mine, so... I don't know what his deal is. Matter of fact, come to think of it, I think I stole that bed. <laughs> I just thought about it, I think it was episode one, I stole that bed. Well, maybe we'll have to give it back, or make the villager a better bed, or make me a better bed. Maybe we won't have the lecture done by the fifth game day. Rise and shine, fifth game day, and I don't think that lecture is even going to be close to be done. So if worse comes to worse, we'll just do the sheep pin. Sorry, you're not my type. And uh, what I'm planning on doing is... I think I made too many sticks. That's okay. Let's go drop these fences off, and then we will... You're an iron golem. I should punch him. Oh, maybe I should just because you told me not to. Oh, that's a horse. Let's make sure here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And this is the corner. So, yes, it works out perfectly. I have a feeling I'm going to be short a few fences. Yep. Just one fence. Isn't that fun? No. Oh, well. I blame the I blame the horse that's in the punishment pen because that's where I'm going after right now. First, I need to get some. Um, I don't need dirt. Actually, I do need dirt because I need to actually. Oh, I already had some. I need to corral the sheep inside. Okay, you're not you're not in timeout anymore. Well, the horse is being rude, obviously. Probably take like half a game day just to s put these sheep in there. I mean, if we don't get that lecture done, at least it's not like somebody's knocking out the door, but 
it's like early in the morning. And trust me, I would be pretty ticked off if somebody started ringing my doorbell at like 3 in the morning. Be like, uh... You know, it's past your bedtime, go to bed. Okay. That's it. Okay. We need to build some sally ports around these too. Right, as far as for the dirt is concerned, I'm just going to fill in that hole. I don't want the horse to laugh at me falling in there all the time, so we're going to fill that in a little bit. Okay. So, um... What we're going to do, we're going to breed these two here. And then we'll see if we can find ourselves some red dye here. Oh, yes. I got two extra fences. Well, we still need to build ourselves a big, massive uh, uh, pig pen. Look at all this wasted space right here. You know what that means. You have to pack that in with dirt. I'm the dirt master. I should have plenty of that. Okay. How's our sugar cane doing? So we're getting close. Like the carrots are getting there. See, you don't know if they're done or not. I think these are done. No. With these new... I may have to put the old textures back in here for the carrots. Or just make my own. And let me grab all that. Well, as you can see, I got a whole area stripped down for a... Whatchamacallit. Yeah, I got the wood. I don't even have the wood. Never mind. I, say, I have the wood to make the lecture, and I can not enough to make the slabs. Although I can rip it from this farm, and there's a tree there I planted, so I can pull it off of that. Pack that right in there. May have to pull this thing down. I think that's dark oak or spruce. Okay. Um, I'm going to collect all the chicken eggs as I can. Let's see here. Let's see if we can get ourselves a lecture going. Now, the thing with. Ooh. Well, I'm going to have to. Uh, there's a chicken in the dark in the corner, then that's that's something worth noting, huh? Maybe he's all emo and depressed today, hiding in the dark. It was a dark one too. You know, I might as well just eat the steak, huh? Look, I just ate I ate something other than uh Potatoes or bread. Alright, so what I want to do now, that's bothering me, put that there, is uh, for sugar cane, I think that's it. We need to get ourselves a good sugar, sugar cane farm going. Back there is going to be the farm, this over here is going to be the livestock. I really do need to be careful in here. Ooh, look, a look, a stalagmite or a stalactite. I never know which ones are which. See how this is bright green on the top? That is ready to be pulled. I got two now. 
Like something's getting EOL'd into the line. Or if you don't want to wait, what you can do is like this one here. You get the seeds. So just pull the whole thing down. There's four. We'll just wait a little bit on these. Or I can just say I'm in a hurry right now and we just pull it all down, huh? There's enough to make a lecture. If I don't have enough wood, I'll snag it from that tree. I just need to make a couple slabs and books. Remember when I first started all this, guys and gals, I didn't have even books even made. I didn't even know what those were when I started. So now everything's kind of gotten a little more advanced. Alright, so where's the lecture net? Well, we're still short some wood. So we're getting there. I got, what, about three minutes left to make it. At least we got farther this time. We found a village. We got villagers. We're learning all the. We've learned all the ropes. We uh, getting a we're getting a meat farm, and we got ourselves a vegetable farm. We just got to get ourselves a sugar farm, and then we're ready to go. Um, let's do another one here. So what you do, if you don't know how to make a lecture, you got to make a bookshelf. Everybody knows how to make these. And then when you do this, I had to remember this the hard way. You do it like a T. And there you go. Here. Okay. Got to do the selfie. Why not? Okay. I'm trying to remember which one it was here. <laughs> All right. Me and my makeshift uh, scan. Let's see if we can position ourselves right by the lecture in here. I want to go on the other side here. Every All the keys are backwards, so sometimes, you know, I guess some people complain that I'm too slow on this. Remember, I'm not playing with the game controller either. <laughs> um, some have said, well, you're slow, you don't know how to use that. Well, we don't have game controllers and... Uh, and what you call it. So I turn that off, take a screenshot, lecture in time. There we go. Now let's go ahead and put this by a villager here. I already know which house to put it in. Here, Merry Christmas. You got yourself a new trade. So I'm the trade fairy tonight. So we did get the lecture and build, so to, not tomorrow, but the next episode I'm going to see if we can cycle through his trades and see if we can get him to get us some decent trades. Looks like it's already dark out here, well, that's just how this game is. So that's it everyone, good night, except I gotta kick you out of my bed, that's mine. And if you haven't already subscribed, please feel free to do so. Tell me what you think of my episodes. Aww.